Hello guys, uh, welcome back to my channel. My name is Junaid. Um, so today I'm at, as you can see, Kisan Indo British Fusion Restaurant. It's a new place. They've only been open for, for about four or five weeks. Um, so this, this place is in Warsaw. So I heard good things about this place. Apparently this place is like the next farmhouse in Coventry. Um, so I have also did a review on that. So make sure you see that. I'll link that up somewhere at the top somewhere. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it a go. So let's go inside. So I'm back from the restaurant. It was so noisy there, so I couldn't record anything while I'm eating the food. So I thought, let me come back and we'll take it from there. In terms of the food, what I had was the kernel. The steak was okay. It wasn't the greatest. What I didn't like, one of the biggest fallbacks actually, when I have a steak, I usually get asked how you want your steak. They want it well done, rare, medium rare. At the Kisans, I did not get asked at all, which was kind of strange to be honest. People want it in a particular way, but I wasn't asked that. Um, now, I went with family. Now, some of my other family members also had, they also had a steak as well. Neither did they get asked um, as to how they want their steak, which is a shame. Um, so by default, I got mine and my family members also got theirs as well done now obviously i don't like my steaks well done i like my steaks medium rare but the steak itself obviously it's you know it wasn't the greatest um the, the mac was okay um the chips were standard the peppercorn sauce that came with it nothing special as well if i was to give it out of 10 i'd give it a 6 out of 10 only because the steak had a nice sort of taste to it but that's about it. Like I said, I went with my family. Um, so obviously they all had different things and I did taste some of them. They gave me their reviews as to what they would give it out of 10. One of the things that they had was, uh, was a T-bone steak. Um, again, like I said, steak was well done by default. That was given a seven out of 10. Um, also a sirloin steak, that was also given a seven out of 10. Um, then you had the Parmesan fully loaded. Parmesan fully loaded looked nice. It did kind of fill up the, the whole plate. Uh, what they gave it was also a seven out of 10 as well. And the teriyaki mermaid was a, probably one of the most popular ones that my family had had. Um, so that was given a eight out of 10. Kebabish was given also a eight out of 10 as well. In terms of the place, the people, the food, like I said, the place looks nice. Um, it's a new place, there's no car parking facilities. What I heard was this restaurant is like the next farmhouse. Now, I went there thinking, you know what, this is gonna be really good. If people are saying this is like farmhouse, um, then I had high expectations. Short answer is no, definitely nothing compared to, to farmhouse. Now, obviously that's not to say I didn't like the place or didn't like the food. The comparison between the farmhouse and the Kisans the only comparison I, I can say is just the logo. The logo is similar um, to, to the farmhouse, but the food does not compare to it. Now, obviously, farmhouse has been there far, far longer than, than the Kisans, okay? Now, obviously, farmhouse is established now. Um, they've been there for many, 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 many years. The Kisans have only been there for, for a matter of just probably over a month now. Um, so they've still got a long way to go. I'm sure they can also make improvements as well. But one thing they definitely need to improve on, um, as a steak lover myself, you need to be asking how you want your steak. Now, I don't, I don't know if that's something that they just forgot to do um, or if, if they don't do that. Because like I said, I got my steak well done and a lot of my family members also got their steaks well done. 
that's what I thought of the place. When I spoke to the guys, uh, they were friendly, they were nice, um, they were quite welcoming as well. If I was to recommend this place to other people, I would say so. I would say, yeah, I would definitely go with that because like I said, um, there are other things on there uh, which looked appealing, which obviously I didn't taste or didn't eat. Um, so obviously I would definitely look to go ahead and try those. If you like your steaks well done only, then I would definitely go there. So as to what I thought of the place, the place looks nice. Um, it's newly decorated. It's not the biggest. Overall, my whole experience, food, everything, the food that my family have had as well, I would give it probably about a 7 out of 10. So that was what I thought of the restaurant Kisans. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did like it, make sure that you do comment, subscribe and like this video. Thank you for my family members for giving me their honest reviews. But yeah guys, I mean that's it for this video anyway. Look out for more videos to come. I'll see you on the next one.